This is a question from chemical engineering from gate 2013, question number 34. 100 ton per hour of a rock feed of which 80% pass through a mesh size of 2.54 millimeter were reduced in size such that 80% of the crushed product passed through a mesh size of 1.27 millimeter. The power consumption was 100 kilowatts. If 100 ton per hour of the same material is similarly crushed from a mesh size of 5.08 mm to a mesh size of 2.54 mm, the power consumption in kilowatt to the nearest integer using Bond's law is dash. So this is a question from size reduction laws in mass transfer of, uh, in mechanical operations and the, the NPTEL lectures can be found in unit 3 lecture 14 loss of communication to mechanical operations by professor Shabina Khanam department of chemical engineering IIT Roorkee. So here they have they are following Bond's law for size reduction. And by Bond's law, the equation for Bond's law is P by M dot is equal to K into 1 by root of DB minus 1 by root of d a where p is the power consumed m dot is the feed rate in tons per hour d b and d a are the dia of the feed and product and k is the constant the bond's law constant so let us write down all the data that they have given in this question So, in the first part of the question, they have given the sizes 2.54 millimeter was reduced to a size of 1.27 millimeter. So, we will write the Bond's law for this size reduction first. So, let us take it as 1. The diameter DA is given as 2.54 mm db is given as 1.27 mm the power consumed p is given as 100 kilowatt and the mass feed rate m dot is given as 100 ton per hour now we just write the bond's law again the bond's law states that p by m dot is equal to k into 1 by root of db minus 1 by root of da and here we have all the values except for this constant k so what we need to do here is substitute all these values here and find the constant k so, substituting all these values, we can write 100 by 100 is equal to k into 1 by root of 1.27 minus 1 by root of 2.54. And solving this equation, we can get the constant k is equal to 3.84. 7, 6. Now, all we have to do is 
use this value for the constant k in the second size reduction that they have asked us to find which is the size reduction from 5.08 mm to 2.54 mm so now we have the value for k which is 3.8476 and in the second case da is 2.54 mm and db is 5.08 mm and the power p is the unknown here and the mass flow rate m dot is given as 100 ton per hour so now in the second case since we found out the constant k from the last case using that constant and using these new diameters of the feed and the product as well as the mass flow rate we need to find the power consumed so again we use the same bond's law p by m dot is equal to k into 1 by root of db minus 1 by root of da so we will substitute all the values that we have p by 100 is equal to k which is 3.8476 into 1 by root of db which is given in the question 1 by root of 5.08 and if we solve for this p we can get the power consumed p is equal to 70.71 kilowatt So the right answer here which is the power consumed for this size reduction is 70.71 kilowatt and to the nearest integer this will approximately become 71 kilowatt.